Hey guys, it's Carter. Welcome back to the channel. Hope you guys are all having a fantastic day today. Now in today's video, we are jumping in and we are looking at the absolute best, the best AI ETF for 2024. So I hope you guys all enjoy it. If you guys do like, subscribe, do what you guys do. And if you guys want to learn more about investing and trading in the market, check out my school down below. You guys can use code YouTube for 20% off. We talk about how to find stocks that are undervalued, stocks with opportunity. Pretty much it's a one-stop shop for all of your trading and investing needs. It's absolutely fantastic. And guys, trust me, I know when people think of YouTubers selling courses, they cringe. But I'm telling you, guys, we have private live streams, quizzes, lectures. I teach you the proper steps in order to become a trader. So check it out down below and code YouTube for 20% off. But guys, let's jump into the absolute best. AI ETF. So one of the reasons why I love artificial intelligence is one, a lot of analysts think that the the average growth rate per year for the next 10 years is 42%. 42%. So if we can make some money off that, that is going to be absolutely fantastic. So the ETF that we're going to be talking about has a whole bunch of fantastic companies that are pulled together that are heavily invested into AI. So let's jump into this here. So guys, the ETF is ticker symbol AIQ. One of the absolute beautiful reasons why I love this is the top 10 holdings in here are awesome. We got companies like NVIDIA, Tencent. Um, we got QCOM, Netflix, Meta, Google, Amazon, Alibaba, Broadcom, Oracle. All these companies are heavily invested into either technology, artificial intelligence, software, data. And guys, the growth on this thing is literally off off the charts in the past five years we've seen a growth rate of near and around a hundred a hundred and twenty one percent a hundred and twenty one percent look at the growth at the of this thing yes we have seen some volatility with it with ups some ups and downs but a hundred and twenty one percent in the past five years in the past six months it's already up fifteen percent Yes, 15%. Now, this thing has historically beaten the S&P 500, the Dow Jones, the NASDAQ. And on top of that, you guys can see the sectors here. The sectors here are heavily invested. You guys can see 65% is heavily invested into technologies. Then we got communication services. We got um, cu uh, customer in uh, industrial and then we got China and you know United States. And so for me to answer this question of is this the best AI ETF? I definitely think at least for me and in my strategies and the way that I invest, I would rather invest into a pool of companies than trying to pick the next Apple or the next Microsoft. I definitely think that there's going to be a huge amount of companies that benefit largely from artificial intelligence and yes, I'm sure it's going to be Nvidia and Apple and Google Google, all the companies you and I love, but I also think there's going to be a lot smaller companies that you and I probably haven't even heard yet that are, going to, that are going to explode. So the beautiful thing about investing into these types of ETFs is you're pretty much investing into that sector. Now, then what I would do is after you guys invest into that sector, then pick companies that you like. So if you like Nvidia, invest into it. If you like Google, Amazon, you know Microsoft, then start investing into those. But looking at the holdings, you guys can see almost every single company in here is either a tech company data software or artificial intelligence company you know ranging from google to microsoft salesforce cisco tesla you know adobe we got intel we got so many fantastic companies that are just heavily invested into these great AI um, ET or yeah, that are invested into AI. So for me to answer that question too, of how should you invest, right? Cause we always hear the expression of buy low, sell high. So it's hard to invest when stocks or this, in this case, an ETF is at all time highs. So for me, what I do is I dollar cost average it. Dollar cost averaging is investing just consistently. So maybe you invest once a week or once every other week into this ETF. What this does is it gives you a 
good average price uh, for, for this ETF. Now, the reason why is because if that just say this thing just sells off, you know, if that just say it goes from $34 back down to 24, then you're just continuing to buy those dips. So once it recovers, you make a lot more money because your average cost moves down and down and down and then it goes up. So guys, this is a very, very great. This is probably the best AI ETF. I hope you guys all enjoyed it. Let me know down in the comments if you guys are buying it, but we'll see you guys in the next one. Like, subscribe, and I hope you guys have a fantastic rest of your day. Take care.